Thanks for connecting with us here online at The Guardian. We're setting down one-on-one -on -one with Prince Edward Island Premier Robert Giz for our annual year-end interview. It will be seen on Eastlink TV. Check the schedule at the bottom of the page for the details. And Premier Robert gives this question exclusively online. Let's talk a little bit about 2014, a big year celebration, the 150th anniversary of the Charlottetown Conference. What's planned for this province in 2014? Well, I think it could be one of the biggest years ever uh, for our province. If you look back to uh, the centennial, that was obviously uh, a big year, but 2014 will kick off the celebrations uh, for the 150th anniversary of Canada in 2017. Uh, but w w Canadians and Islanders all have to realize that we would not have that celebration in 2017 if it was not for a meeting here in Charlottetown, Prince Edward Island in 1864. And that meeting really laid the foundation for the formation of the greatest country in the world. And uh, for us, it's going to be about celebrating our past, celebrating our future, looking to where we've been and where we can go. Uh, and, uh, you know, we're going to partner uh, with the federal government with year-long celebrations. Um, and hopefully there'll be some good legacy projects uh, out of it as well. And uh, from my perspective, uh, we've got uh, David McKenzie we've brought over, who is now the CEO of uh, the 150th uh, celebration. I've worked with uh, Minister Shea on it numerous times, have numerous discussions. I've spoken to the Prime Minister. Uh, you know, we're hoping Canada Day ceremonies will be here in Prince Edward Island. Uh, we're hoping we'll have another visit from the Royal Couple, that there'll be concerts, that there'll be the Young Company, that there'll be more celebrations. Um, and, uh, you know, the, the line I use is I hope Islanders are complaining about traffic in 2014 <laughs> uh, because I really want to invite Canada to Prince Edward Island to have the opportunity to celebrate the meeting uh, that uh, formed our nation. And uh, I'm obviously excited about it. I think that there's a lot of great opportunity uh, out there. Uh, and uh, I'm looking forward to partnering uh, with the federal government to make sure that uh, in 2014 uh, that Prince Edward Island uh, will be the place to visit. A legacy project. A lot of people are hoping it'll be a provincial museum. How are we getting along? Will we have a provincial museum in 2014? Who knows? It, it all depends on, on funding. Uh, and uh, obviously uh, the federal government needs to come on side with that uh, but you know there's people calling for a provincial museum there's other legacy projects out there too people talking about revamping the confederation center of the arts perhaps looking at the seven museums we have across our province and revamping them uh, you know there's a lot of different things uh, that we can undertake and uh, we'll do some public consultations and try to come back with the best possible answer but uh, the most important thing is make sure that those dollars are there from the federal government. Wonderful. Well, the invitation has been extended to all Canadians. If you're watching, be in Prince Edward Island in 2014. We have a lot more in our conversation. In fact, a full hour with Premier Robert Giz. It will air on Eastlink TV and be printed in The Guardian over the holidays. Please read, please watch, and stay with us for news 24-7 at www.theguardian.pe.ca. Thanks for watching. And thank you, Premier. Thank you.